Come forward, please. Praise God. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Okay. Uh, I want someone to start uh, pray by prayer. Um, is there anyone who is going to pray for us? Um, okay. You. God, think first thing, God. Without you, will not be created. If 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 you is not here, that means we will not be here because you created us, Jesus. All the people that said, please can we give them a chance, Jesus. We love you. You died in the cross to forgive our sin, Jesus. We love so much in Christ, Amen. Amen. God bless you. you. Um, are you guys ready for our Bible verses? Yes. Everybody has his own? Okay. Already? Okay. Where do you guys want me to start from? This Okay. This time. Okay. Psalms 23. The Lord is my shepherd and I lack nothing. He makes me lie down in, in green pastures. He leads me beside quiet waters. He refreshes my soul. He guides me along the right paths for his name's sake. Even though I walk through the darkest valleys, I shall, I will fear no evil. You are me, with me. Your road and your staff will comfort me. You prepare a table before me in the presence of my enemies. You anoint my head with oil. My cup overflows. Surely your goodness, hope, and love will follow me all the days of my life, and I will dwell in the, in the house of the Lord forever. God bless you. My name, God bless you. Okay, um, Christian. Isaiah 55, verse 9. As the heavens are higher than the earth, so are my ways higher than your ways, and my thoughts than your thoughts. God bless you. Amen. God bless you. Who's next? You. Oh, yeah. For God so loved the world that he gave his one and only son, that whoever believed in him to not perish but have eternal life. Amen. God bless you. Nine. The Lord is my strength and my Him. 
Thanks for all, 52. God bless you. Who is next? Take care, Abigail. God in the face of Jesus Christ. God bless you. Psalms 9, uh, verse 1 and 2. I will give thanks to you, Lord, with all my heart. I will tell you of I will tell I will tell of all your wonderful deeds. I will be glad and rejoice in you. I will sing the praises of your name almost. Amen. God bless you. As God lives, who has taken away my right, and the Almighty who has made my soul bitter, as long as my breath is in me and the Spirit of God is in my nostrils, my lips will not speak um, falsehood and my tongue will not utter uh, deceit. Far, far be it from me to say that you are right. Till I die, I will not put away my injurity in, in from me. I hold fast to my righteous, to my righteousness, and I will not let it go. My heart does not re reproach me for any of my days. Let my enemy be as the wicked, and let him who rises against me be as the unrighteous. For what is the hope of godless when the God cuts him off, when God takes away his life? Will God hear his cry when distress comes upon him? Will he take delight in the, Almighty, in the Almighty? Will he call upon God at all times? I will teach you, I will teach you concerning the hand of God. What is with the Almighty? I will not conceal. Behold, all of you have seen it yourselves. Then why have then have you become um, altogether vain? This is the portion of wicked man with God, and the heritage that oppressors receives from the Almighty. If his children are multiplied, multiplied it, it is from the sword, and it has descendants have and his descendants have not enough bread. Those who survive him, the pestilence burns and his win widow do not weep though he hip up sliver like dust and peel up coating like clay he may peel up pull it up but the righteous will will wear it and the innocent will divide the silver he builds his house like a moth like a moth that a watchman makes he goes to bed rich but will not do so no more he opens his eyes and his wealth is gone. Terrors, terrors, terrors overtake him like a flood in the night and whirl, whirlwind carries him off. The east wind lifts, lifts him up and he is gone. It re sweeps him out of his place. It hurls at him without pity. He flees from it, power and headlong flight. Fifteen. Praise God. Redeem the time because the days are evil. Amen. Josh. Praise be to God, the Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, who has blessed us in the heavenly realms. Praise be to God, the Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, who has blessed us in the heavenly realms with every spiritual blessing in Christ. For he has chosen us before the creation of the world to be holy and blameless of sin and love. God bless you. Christian. Wadero Mesa Watchmate Raf Asraf Hulatsko Tai Hulat. 
Yexabirin, Fekal Assum, the Gona des Yemiasin, Fetsumem, Yohono, Neger, Men in the Hone, Fetsnachu, Tawaku, Zend Belebachu, Metades, Telewatu, Inji, Yehin, Alem, Atem Selu. Do not come form any longer to the pattern of this world but be transformed by the renewing or your mind of your mind then you will be able to test and approve what god's will is his good pleasing and perfect will amen god bless you who's next next shalom shalom God bless. you have been saved did not for it is by grace you have been saved and this is not from yourselves it is the gift of 
God, not by works, so that no one can boast. Luke, Luke, would you come, please? You can say, Jesus loves you. Jesus loves us. Amen. 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 I will praise you, Lord, although you were angry at me, your anger has turned away. You have comforted me. Surely God is my salvation. I trust you and I will trust you and not be afraid. The Lord, the Lord himself is my strength and my defense. Betty. Hear me, my God, as I voice my complaint. Protect my life from the tree of the enemy. Hide me from the conspiracy of the wicked, from the plots of elvidors. They sharpen their thumbs like swords and aim cruel words like deadly arrows. They shoot from ambush at the innocent. They shoot suddenly without fear. They encourage each other in evil plans. They talk about hiding their snares. They say, who will see it? They paw injustice and say, we have deceived a perfect plan. Surely the human mind and heart are canoeing, but God will shoot them with his arrows. It will suddenly be struck down. He will turn their own thumbs against them and bring them to turn. All who see them will shake their heads in scorn. All people will fear. They will proclaim the works of God and ponder that he has done. The righteous will rejoice in the Lord and take refuge in him. All the upright in a heart will glory in him. Psalm 64, 1 to 10. God with all your heart, all your soul, and all your mind, and love your neighbors as yourself. Everyone to whom my words can and who does them will be like a wise man who built a house on a rock. Matthew 7, verse 24. Selezi yihin alen samito yamiya dargoso. Ulu betum ba alat le yisera le bam sawin kubesla. Matthew Morgan sapat haya aran. Lord strong and mighty, mighty battle. John 11. Is there anyone who hasn't said any verse? No. Okay. We have all have done. Okay. Um. Um. Noha. Can you speak, please? Jesus is Lord. 
This is his Lord. God bless you. God bless you. Praise God. Okay. Um, you guys remember what we learned last time? I'm just starting, no, I'm continuing from where I stopped last time. And we have been learning about the attributes of God. Do you remember those things? Who remembers about the attributes of God? Those are the exceptional characteristics of God. And those characters are not just by any human being or any creation, just only to God. So before I move over to the new one, I want you guys to remember some of them if you can. I'm not just forcing you. Um, Abigail. Omniscient. Yep. And omnipotent. Omnipresent. Yes. God. Okay, he got it. Okay. We learned about three major attributes so far. And today we are going to learn one more thing. Are you ready? Yeah. I'm going to ask you next time. If you don't remember... You know, you are going to embarrass yourself, not me, you know. Um, most of you are able to remember everything because I didn't give you enough time to contemplate in what was it. But anyway, you were able to do it and we are going to do the fourth one today. Okay, one of the major attributes of God is he is immutable. Do you know what immutable is? Anyone who can tell me what immutable is? Yes, please. Okay. Okay. He said someone who could not be muted. That's what she said. Immutable. Have you ever heard about the recent viral diseases in the world around? What is this? Viral disease that has attacked the world recently, two years, three years before? Coronavirus. Coronavirus. And have you heard a recent one, a kind of which is similar to the first one, but there is another virant type of virus showed up. That is the mutation of the virus. Mutation of the virus means changing the characteristic. But God is immutable. That means God never changes in his character. Because, I mean, we do have a lot of reasons to change in the opinions or in the decisions that we made. But God never changes. Why do you think so? Yes, please. He never makes mistakes. That is a wonderful answer. But still more. I mean, like... You have some truths and you don't want to change those things. You insist on that. But if your daddy says, please, Abigail, can you just make some move on these things? Can you make any changes? Can you do please for me or for your mom's sake? You may try to make some changes. But there is no force that can force God to change his righteous plans in the life of human being. And that is why we call God is immutable. Is that Claire, do you get the idea what I was trying to say? Yeah. Okay. And in the book, in the Bible, there are many places where we see God has demonstrated his immutability. Malachi book, book of Malachi, chapter 3, 6. Please. Malachi, Malachi, chapter 3, 6. Winter, Zabib, can you tell me what it is? 3, 6, Malachi. Malachi 3, 6. Hey, kids, kids, pay attention here. Next time I'm going to ask you guys. Immutability of God. God never changes. He never changes in his plan that he has for us. It's Malachi chapter 3, verse 6. Okay. You got it? Please. You got it? Can you tell me? Okay. Um... She's going to help, help you. Okay, okay. Malachi, 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 3-6. You have it? Okay. I'm going to give him the chance because he found it. Okay. Okay. Try to remember this thing. Oh, 
not destroyed ever since the time of your forefathers. You have turned away from my decrees. Can you read it again? And listen to him. Listen to him. Look, what is he saying? I, the Lord, do not change so that is enough. I, the Lord, do not change. Because of that reason, you, the children of Jacob or Israel, you are not destroyed. Because I never changed the plan that I have for you. I have a plan to give you life and protect you against any enemies. And I keep that promise. So God never changes his plan in our life. You got it? That is his immutable characters. Or his what we call the four attributes. So far we have tried to see about four attributes. The fourth one is God is immutable. Immutable. He never changes. Like viruses change from one nature to another nature and they will be difficult for the physicians to treat those kind of diseases. But God never changes. God bless you. Who can pray for us and we're going to be going back to the class. Um, I want to give chance to someone who never had that. Okay, let me give you, please. Clouds, I will see it and remember the everlasting cover and between God and all living creatures of every kind on the so God to Noah. This is the sign of the covenant I have established between me all and all life on the earth. God bless you. Okay, kids, God bless you. We go back to the class.